Searching for the right CAD program can be tricky, and since it is a tool that you'll be investing in and living in, you want to make sure you're making the right decision. This short post will be used to help distinguish the differences between Keisha and SolidWorks to help you figure out which of the two is best suited for your business. What other contributors will influence your decision? Factors such as design philosophy, industry preference, compatibility with other tools, ease of use, data management, and more. Today, there are a multitude of CAD systems to choose from. Make sure to ask partners and other businesses that you will be working with what tool they're using, especially if you will be sharing CAD files with them. Modeling. There are many things that both software can do just as well as the other. But when it comes to more complex applications, each alternative shines in their own specializations. A commonly used adage comparing the two is Keisha's for designing cars and SolidWorks for its components. Keisha is a sophisticated and powerful tool for sketching, drawing, and modeling. Although there is a larger learning curve for using it, you can achieve rewarding designs with accuracy and precision. Where Keisha shines is with its advanced surface, modeling tools available. SolidWorks is an industry-dominating program with a wider spread of designers and industries than Keisha. With an intuitive UI and design tools, SolidWorks follows the designer as they create features and is smart enough to do the heavy lifting for you. SolidWorks is designed to be intuitive and provide you with the most efficient workflows available at your fingertips. They have perfected their focus on parametric modeling and is ideal for machinery-related projects. Collaboration. Interacting with other products is important since modern businesses have many other tools implemented for operations. When looking at Keisha and SolidWorks on the platform, Dassault has made it clear that having the two integrate with the platform is a main priority for operating on the cloud. The Keisha and SolidWorks file formats on the platform are designed to eliminate disconnect from other apps in the platform so there's no need to translate between the applications. Outside of the 3 experience platform, Keisha has a PDM workbench, PWB for CAD-specific PDM functionality, as SolidWorks has SolidWorks PDM and Manage. Libraries Since Keisha is updated every year since the early 2000s, it comes with over 100 original products that can be used with Keisha. There's also the ability to integrate other libraries seamlessly since it is such a flexible program. SolidWorks has its own integrated libraries that are available as well as libraries that can easily be imported from Dassault resources or partner products. There are also many compatible partner products to populate the library with manufacturer parts, symbols, PWGs, and more. Add-ins both programs come with a slew of add-ons in supporting software to expand the reach past the 3D modeling space. Cost If you have been shopping around for your CAD software, you already know that none are cheap. Understandably so, since the digitization of these complex processes is a costly process. SolidWorks is the more affordable option out of the two, making it more accessible to individual, students, and smaller businesses. As a rule of thumb, it is around a third of the cost of Keisha. Overview. The two programs both share many similarities when it comes to modeling capabilities. Although cars and planes can be created in SolidWorks, the advanced surfacing and focus on those types of models makes Keisha the preferred solution. Designing all the components and mechanisms within those cars and planes is a different story. SolidWorks is one of most used programs in the world. It is more likely that suppliers or other stakeholders in your value chain will be using SolidWorks than Keisha which is something to consider for collaboration when choosing a software. Both have their own roster of add-ons and libraries that come with different levels of licenses, so that will have to be a discussion needed to be had with your VAR. Finally, SolidWorks is undoubtedly the more affordable option of the two, accessible to more businesses and individuals looking for CAD software. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.